In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to draw a circle using Desmos. Now, Desmos is an online application. You'll find it at desmos.com. And what we're going to do in this lesson is just to draw a circle. Now, the default form for a circle is x squared plus y squared equals the radius squared. So looking at this uh, Cartesian uh, plane here, what I want to do is to draw a circle which is centered at the origin and has a radius of 4. So if I turn on this first equation here, we can see that x squared plus y squared equals 4 squared. We have a circle here with a radius of 4. Now as we can see, this one is centered at the origin, 0, 0. But if I want to move it to the left or to the right, I'm going to affect the x ordinate. Let's say I want to move it to the point negative 3, 0. So the center is at negative 3, 0. So if we look at this equation here, what I need to do is to add 3. So I'll turn that on. We can see we now have this blue circle centered at negative 3, 0. Let me just turn off that red one. Now this blue one here, we can see that if we add 3, we move it to the left. And similarly, if we were to subtract 3, we move it to the right. So now the center is at 3, 0, so this point here. Now if I want to move it up or down, then obviously I'm going to affect the y ordinate. And looking at this equation here, here I'm going to add 2. Now by adding 2, that tells me it's going to move down the ways. So if I turn that on, we can see the center of the circle is now at 3, negative 2. I'll turn off that blue one. Now let's say I want a circle with a radius of um, 5 and I want it centered at the point negative 3, 1. Well, if I want it centered at negative 3, 1, I have to add 3. And if I'm at the point 1, I would have to subtract 1. And I wanted a radius, I think I said of 5. So we just put 5 in there. And there we have our circle. So it's centered at negative 3, 1. So there's the center of the circle here with a radius of 5.